Hey everyone, welcome to Mama From Scratch. My name is Emily, if you were new, and thank you so much for stopping by. Today I am here at Hobby Lobby and they have asked me to share with you my 10 favorite fall decor pieces and how I'd personally style them. This is seriously a dream come true to be able to partner with them for today's video, so be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new, and let's go ahead and get started shopping. So the first fall favorite I have are definitely their fall bushels that they have. I have these in my galvanized tins in the entryway. I think they're beautiful. The pine and the, the cotton stems and the pine cones are just gorgeous. But if you're wanting a little bit still on that rustic side and have a darker hue, um, not so vibrant and orange, they're definitely their darker leaves are beautiful. I have these intermixed with a couple of their lighter stems that they have here and the two mixed together definitely make for a beautiful combination in the floral tins. More fall florals for you are the wheat that they have. It is very real looking. It is gorgeous. They have multiple varieties for you to choose from. Second favorite for fall would be centerpieces. You could do the traditional fall colors with the reds and the oranges or you could stick to a more neutral palette but either way you have beautiful options for your dining room table, your coffee table and many different ideas that you can choose from. Number three would definitely have to be their garlands. They have so many beautiful colors and options to choose from but what I like about this option is that you could actually string this around a grapevine wreath if you wanted to. You could put this above your doorway spread this across your dining room table as well as your mantle beautiful ways to style their garlands but if you look to this side over here you will see they have tons of different um, little floral accents as well as pumpkins and multiple different colors that you can insert into the garland to spruce it up a little bit more and add that personal touch to it so again DIYing a few of the um, decor pieces that they have but so many beautiful options in here. So you guys know that I am just a bit of a pumpkin hoarder and I have a ton of them throughout the house this year, but I love the different styles that Hobby Lobby has. They have the metal ones, they have ceramic, they have the traditional style that you can easily layer throughout your house. You can use them as a focal piece on a shelf or you can layer them up your doorway, um, up the, down the staircase. There's a lots of different ways that you can style these and they are super affordable and love decorating with pillows. I think it's a great way to introduce the different seasons into your home but if you're looking for a subtle way to do it you could do stick with more neutral color schemes and do ones that just have simple words on them like blessed or thankful and blessed or you could do ones that have the ticking stripe on them which is really gorgeous as well or the buffalo check all of these are great options to introduce a season into your home without it being overpowering something that I really enjoy when you come to Hobby Lobby is they have beautiful displays already done for you to give you lots of different ideas for a particular season so here they have styled up the thankful metal sign which is absolutely gorgeous they have the picture with the green pumpkins, the green sunflowers, the hint of creamy white in there. Have the trays that you can style in your home as well as the thankful and blessed pillow. So you're getting a lot of different ideas from this, but you could add candles to this. You could add the wood candlesticks to this area and you can pick from everything right in this whole section. Okay, totally make my heart flutter. This is absolutely gorgeous. You guys know the color scheme I'm going with this year is definitely that burnt orange with the blacks and the whites. And this is just heavenly to me. Look how beautiful this is. There are so many different pieces here. You have the throws that you could add to your couch or your chair or even your table. You could use this on for a tablescape. But then you have the beautiful orange chargers, but you also have the Bingham check chargers. These are gorgeous, you guys. So many different ways you can style these in your house. If you don't want to per se use them on your dining room table, you could actually use them as a tray and build up um, pumpkins and florals on top of it for a beautiful um, bottom piece as well. Wreaths are definitely another fall favorite for me to decorate with. I love the fact that you could use the cotton stem ones. You can put these on your door or you can actually add them to signs like a shiplap sign or you can add them to a tobacco basket. They're very beautiful. They're a great piece. Or you could stick with a more traditional magnolia wreath if you wanted to. Or you could do, again, obviously your fall traditional wreaths with the beautiful oranges and reds and the pumpkins on them like I have made. Definitely a beautiful way to decorate your house for really inexpensive and it's a timeless piece. Or galvanized tins. They have ones that have beautiful sayings on them. You can have your florals come out of them. You can put them on your porch as well, but also on your tablescapes. They have the cake trays, which are beautiful for putting pumpkins on as well. But look how big and beautiful some of these tins are. They are gorgeous and they're a great way to decorate for fall. The fall signs and word cutouts. I think this is beautiful. Look how chunky this thankful sign is. It is gorgeous. It has that chippy feel to it. 
oh, it's heavenly, you guys. But they have so many different options for you to choose from, from traditional small signs to a little bit more rustic, larger signs. And then they have the metal signs, everything. There's just so many beautiful options to style up your home. You can add them to your entryway, your mantle, uh, your dining room, whatever it might be, they're perfect. The last item I wanna share with you is a doormat. This is a great way to style up your house because it's the first thing that your guests will see as they come through the doorway. And having something beautiful that reminds them of fall and lets them know that they are welcome is a great way to enter them into your home. So I hope you all enjoyed coming to Hobby Lobby with me and seeing all their beautiful fall decor pieces and how I would personally style some of them. There are so many beautiful options. I hope that you'll be able to go to a local store near you or shop online as well. That way you can make your home feel beautiful, cozy, and festive for this fall season. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're a new because I'd love to inspire and motivate you here. And I wish you all a beautiful, wonderful day. And thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. I'll say bushels because that's what you normally say. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> okay. This is your south. Then, what did I use before? I don't say border, right? I think it happens to it seven times. Well, what was the first clip, though? It was that.